Hey guys, what's up? So this is the series number seven where we'll see some more questions of Selenium interview. And before to start, this is brief about me. Uh, myself, Bhanu Pratap, and I come from Bihar. And this is my Facebook page and channel, so that you can subscribe my channel and like my Facebook page. And the GitHub locations where you'll have all my source code. So let me start with another set of questions where a lot of times people will ask you, how do you work with properties file? How do you read data from the properties file? And they will ask you the method for that. Let me make one properties file here. So just go to the file and I will write, let's say I will write or dot properties, right? So I just made a properties file here. I will write user name is equal to, let's say I will write uh, Bhanu Pratap, right? And I will come to the my series number seven and here what i will do is i will make the object of properties class because in java properties is a class so i will make the object of properties class then just place mouse over here no don't add this just place mouse over here and click on java util okay go for the java util one and place mouse over here click on that so just make the object of properties class and then you need to make the file object so you can just write because properties is a file so we have to make the file object and in the file object we need to supply the path of the file so here we can write system dot get property so when we say system dot get property user dot dir this will give you locations till your project which means this will give you locations till your uh, the, this project which is nothing but selenium and then inside that we have to write plus uh, in double quote we need to just do a right click go to the properties so till selenium you will get till here system dot get property user dot dir it will give you then from here we need to copy this so what we can do from here we can copy this and we can just place it here right after that place mouse over here click on file object so we have the file object now uh, we will make the input stream reader object because i want to read the file in one shot so i'll make input stream reader input stream reader or i'll make input reader better i'll make the object of input reader so this input reader what it will do we need to supply this argument right so uh, what i'll do is here i will supply file argument or let's say instead of making input stream reader we can go for file input stream better and then i will tell you why we should go file input stream see this file input stream will help you to read all content of the file in one shot right so make the object of file input stream you can read all data as a stream of data in one shot it will load everything in the memory and once you have the input stream so this will throw the exceptions file not found exceptions because if the file is not present you will get file not found and then you do or dot load so you need to load your input stream right so your data got loaded and this guy will also throw the exceptions input output so both becomes you know input output exceptions now how to read that to read that on this reference or dot we have a property is called get property and we will supply the key so what is the key here username right save the project so when i say here read data username i should get bhanu pratap when i run this so let me write this into a print statement so that you know we will come to know whether it is printing or not so let me just run as file not found exception 
इट इज सेइंग दैट ओ आर डॉट प्रॉपर्टीज तो सेलेनियम क्वेश्चन एंड सेलेनियम 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 क्वेश्चन एंड एंसर ओके लेट मी लुक एट द फाइल लोकेशन अगेन ओके आई डिड मिस्टेक सो हियर टिल हियर यू विल गेट बिकॉज टिल योर प्रोजेक्ट सो टिल सेलेनियम इज योर प्रोजेक्ट लुक एट हियर आई विल शो यू वॉट मिस्टेक आई डिड सो टिल सेलेनियम इज योर प्रोजेक्ट सो टिल हियर यू विल गेट okay there is one error in my project let me correct the error so some po uh, error we have here just remove that yeah now there is no error so till selenium when you write system dot get property user dot dir you will get after selenium you have to write the location so do a right click go to the properties of that so till selenium you will get so from src we have to write actually from src cancel this and here we need to write from the src right and this will work in any system in any directory because till project will get a locations here i am not hard coding d drive c drive no if i do hard coding this script will not work in other systems so let me run this see you are getting bhanu pratap right that's how properties file works in the in the java and that's how we can utilize in the selenium also then what are the java script function for selenium object location this is very important questions like what are the functions you can use for located writing so i'll tell you couple of functions we can use following siblings we can use following siblings we can use uh, preceding sibling we can use start with starts hyphen with we can use ends with so these are the functions you can remember these are the functions we can use we can also use following and we can also use preceding right and we can use a function called contains so these are all javascript functions actually so these are the functions we can use while writing xpath this this you guys can remember this sometimes people they will ask you similarly uh, in css also you have nth child concept right and here you can supply the child number one two anything and similarly in the css uh, you can write uh, and so dollar symbol this says that it starts with so this means it starts with starts with this means in css similarly when you write power bracket this means ends with so these are the functions which we use in the locator writing so these you guys can remember and this locator writing video i have already made very nice video in my selenium locators playlist where you will have video number 1 2 3 a uh, selenium locator writer 1 2 3 you can watch that you will come to know what uh, these uh, uh, functions means right so this questions you can expect in the interview with this we are done with the seventh series and this series will still continue and uh, you guys can keep on watching and enjoy learning the selenium thank you guys thank you for watching this like my video and subscribe my channel thank you once again